<laughs> Kim and Danny Harris play with their son Caleb after an afternoon nap. Ready? They enjoy seeing Caleb smile because he didn't smile often during the first four months of his life. I just remember being very scared. At the time I thought uh, we were going to lose our son. Where is it? Caleb was born with hypoplastic right heart syndrome, a very rare and potentially deadly heart defect in which the right side of his heart was malformed. Oh, I still look at that picture and it, it just, it gives me the chills every time I see it. Caleb was rushed to Shands at UF so doctors could try and save his life. We didn't even know where Shands was. They soon would find out. Caleb spent the next four months in the neonatal intensive care unit and the pediatric intensive care unit, waiting for a heart transplant with his mother by his side. And I would just cry and I remember I had a lot of nurses that would come and just, I mean I had one that just hugged me and she would cry with me and I had a couple nurses that just sat and cried with me. It would, it's been a lot. At times, Kim would need to leave Caleb at the hospital. She hated to leave him alone. But the medical staff at Shands at UF helped ease her mind because they treated Caleb like their own child. And I would come in and I would see some of them just rocking him. And it may have meant so much more. It was like he had, you know, 20 moms. <laughs> and with the love and the around the clock care of 20 moms, eventually Caleb was sent home without a transplant. Kim likes to stop by Shans at UF to say hello to the people that helped Caleb get better. She wants Caleb's medical family to see how their love and care changes lives. It makes us feel great. It makes us feel like what we do matters to parents, to the patients, to the families um, as a whole. That's what our job is. That's what we're supposed to do. So it feels pretty normal because that's what we do here. Kim and Danny now hope to watch Caleb live a long, healthy life thanks to the care he received at Shands at UF. They know Caleb was in the right place at the right time. I wouldn't want Caleb to be in a different hospital for his situation. At the University of Florida, I'm Chris Bilowich.